Hey everybody, Matt here from Matt's Movies, Music and More, welcoming you to this week's unboxing video. I'm really sorry that I didn't have a video ready for Halloween week, unfortunately. There was other circumstances beyond my control, so I'm going to make it up to you today by talking about two Blu-ray titles that I recently purchased from the retailer HMV. These are exclusive to HMV stores in the UK and their other division, which is called FOP which they have a bunch of branches in the UK. Um, and these titles are horror related, if you're a big fan of British horror especially, because these are two movies from the studio Hammer. I'm a huge Hammer fan and um, have always loved those classic films of Peter Cushing and Christopher Lee. And up today we're going to talk about two movies that have been released by HMV, which are the premium collection edition of films. So first up, we have the 1972 movie Dracula AD 1972, which makes its Blu-ray debut in the UK for the first time. This was available on DVD a few years back and was has long deleted, been deleted since. And also making its Blu-ray debut is the 1973 movie The Satanic Rites of Dracula, which um, has never had a DVD release in the UK. Um, it's, these two are widely derided as these are the final two movies to feature Peter Cushing, Christopher Lee as Van Helsing and Dracula. Uh, to be honest, they're not the best films in the franchise, but they're definitely worth buying if you're a collector of Hammer movies. Now, recently they have been released in the US under the Warner Archive collection, which is a Blu-ray burn-on-demand service. And from what I'm hearing, apparently those versions in America are having audio issues, such as the audio sync is a bit out with the images, so maybe dialogue is being spoken before the words are actually, the, the lips are actually moving. Whereas I can tell you for a fact, after watching both of these films, there are no issues with these UK releases whatsoever. Both films uh, feature English subtitles and the theatrical trailer. That's all they have, sadly. But to be honest, given that they're not the best movies, it's not a big deal. These are currently on offer at the moment in HMV stores on an offer from £15. Or you can buy two for £25. But that offer does change here and there. So I would say jump up on these as fast as you can. Because no doubt these may go out of print. So let's get to the unboxing part of this video and you'll be able to see that. So here we have the premium collection editions of... 1972's Dracula AD 1972, which is shown here on the left, and The Satanic Rites of Dracula from 1973, shown here. These have both been released through HMV stores in the UK. These were released earlier in the year on the Warner Archive Burn On Demand service in the United States, but from what I hear, both of those versions have audio sync issues. I've watched both of these personally and have not noticed any issues whatsoever with these two. So if you do want to buy them and you live in America, the only way you can get them, I'm afraid, is from the HMV stores where they have them, I think, £15 each or two for 25 as this video is currently being made. Um, but I would jump on them fast as it wouldn't surprise me that these might go discontinued pretty quickly. But... Let's talk about the Premium Collection. The Premium Collection is an HMV range in which other studios besides Warner Brothers, including Universal and Sony, to name a few, have got together and brought out these limited edition packagings. So, essentially, they had Blu-ray and DVD combis and sometimes digital codes, but given that digital codes have now been phased out, it, these are just purely Blu-ray, as it says there. Blu-ray... Blu-ray. So, as you'll see, if you're a collector of the HMV Blu-rays for this, you will see that on the side spines for Dracula, we have number 101 from 1972. And for Satanic Rites, it's number 102. Now, for the UK market, um, Dracula AD 1972 was available previously on DVD in the UK. Um, this is the debut of it on Blu-ray. And The Satanic Rites of Dracula has never had an official UK DVD release. The only way we would have been able to get it in the UK is through import, which I believe there was the Anchor Bay Region 1 DVD that was long out of print. And the only other way before after that was... Um, 
these public domain DVDs, which had it under its alternate title, Count Dracula and His Vampire Brides. So let's get into each one. So let's start with Dracula AD 72. So Dracula AD has this outer slipcase and the cover replicates both what's on the front of the case and the back as seen here. So regarding extra features, all the extra features that these two titles have are just English subtitles and the theatrical trailer. Now, what the premium collection does do is they have not just um, a picture inside, as you see here, which I'm going to slip out these bits and pieces, but you have the picture of the gang there, Johnny and his gang. But they also contain, as well, some interesting extra features, such as, which is going to be difficult for me to open on camera, but we have here a poster for the movie. So this is for Dracula AD 72, which... Again, it's very difficult to display, but I will try my hardest to show you as best as I can. So there we go. Um, it's a nice touch. It's not something that really bothers me to have a poster, but, you know, it's, it's one of those gimmicks that they do. And the other things they do, which I didn't open, and that's silly of me, but I'm not going to open them on camera anyways, and that is... There are four postcards in here for the movie. So um, I'm just going to put that back in there and essentially put the disc back. Um, of the two, Dracula AD 72 was a movie that I grew up with as a kid and loved it. Um, watching it again after all these years, it's kind of dated badly, to be honest, given that I really like the gothic ones of the time. Um, I'm glad I own them both. Uh, Satanic Rites was one that... I always wanted to see so here is the satanic rites of dracula making its uk debut for the first time and again the same as the previous just the theatrical trailer and english subtitles um of the two movies to be honest for me i thought the satanic rites was actually pretty poor um i didn't think it was a very good film i actually nearly gave up a few times when watching it um but i stuck through to watch it in the end so, as you see here, here's a picture of one of the victims in the film. And, uh, again, as I said earlier, there's postcards, but I haven't opened them. And let's have a look at the poster for this movie. So, the poster replicates exactly what's on the front cover of the Blu-ray. So, let's show you that quickly. So, that's quite a nice poster, but again... It's not like it's a normal A, A5, A3 type poster size. It It's okay for what it is. It's These aren't the best Hammer movies. So if you're looking to get great classic British Hammer horror films, these two aren't the best. Um, they're worth owning if you're a fan of Hammer horror. Um, and, you know, if you like Christopher Lee and Peter Cushing. But other than that... They're not exactly the best films. Um, I do think that these are probably going to sell out relatively quickly. So um, I'd probably say jump up on them as quickly as you can. So if you can get them on offer for like two for £25, I'd say do so. Otherwise, if you're outside of the UK, you might have to use um, the auction sites out there to maybe buy it from those. So thanks everybody for checking this out and we'll go straight back to the studio. So yeah, that's the... New Blu-ray releases of the two Hammer movies, Dracula AD 1972 and The Satanic Rites of Dracula. Hopefully that makes it up for the Halloween episode being missed. Um, if you are fans of Hammer, it'd be great to hear from you guys. Tell me what your favourite Hammer movies are. If you definitely want to pick these up, I would suggest go to h &V and get them if you can, if you have one local to you. If you're outside of the UK and America and places like that, you may have to jump up on um, famous... Uh, auction sites online to be able to pick these up um, and i'd definitely say get them if you can so thanks everybody for checking out today's video don't forget to check out the other videos on this channel including my other solo videos we have what did you think which i do with my special guest and we have at the movies with andrew which he'll talk about the latest cinema releases so there's plenty of stuff on this channel hopefully more to come in the near future so thank you everybody and all the very best to you bye bye